The day my monster arrived, it terrorised the town. It aimed for my closest friends. It locked its eyes on me. The day my monster arrived, it stole light. It stole fun. It stole joy. The day my monster arrived, I was in my room. At school, doing a maths test. On a trip alone at night. The day my monster arrived, it was big and green. With lots and lots of eyes. The day my monster arrived, it was hiding in my wardrobe. It was sneaking into my room. It was travelling the world and spreading disease. last few ingredients. Someone, get me five grams of niceness. Five grams of niceness? What's next? A dash of got your back, of course. Perfect. This is definitely going to get rid of that monster. Are you absolutely sure it's right? We'll only have one chance for it to work. We can't make any mistakes. When you say only one chance, do you really mean only one chance? Yes, come on, focus. She's right. If we get this wrong, we'll annoy the monster more and it'll only get worse. Maybe we should just leave it? No, come on, we can do this. We just need the last ingredient. The most important thing. Love. When my monster arrived, I felt scared, alone, and wanted to run and hide. It was coming straight for me. I couldn't believe my eyes. The world around me felt different. My head felt busy. My mind emptied. My whole body felt numb. I felt confused and lost. It felt cold and dark. Like a storm was brewing. Have we got word on the status of the potion? Yes, all the ingredients have been gathered. The potion team is bringing it now. It should be ready soon. Excellent. I definitely think this will give us the edge to win this. So what's our plan again? We've got officers on the perimeter waiting for our order to lure the monster into the trap. There are strict instructions to be as quiet as they can. So they don't disturb the monster. Exactly. And then? And then, once we have the monster's location secured, we let the potion work its magic. The monster doesn't stand a chance. It won't know what's hit it. Captain, the monster's coming this way. We don't have long. Are we ready? To your positions. Good luck everyone, we can do this! Come and get us you silly monster! Shh, we're supposed to be quiet, it'll hear you. That's the point! We might lead it into a trap, remember? I think I'm just going to stay here and hide until it goes away. But if it hears us and sees how strong we are, then it might go away. What? No, wait, don't. Why, are you scared? I don't think I want to do it. Let's do it together. Ready, set, go! <laughs> to my mum. We 
talked about it together. She told me we were safe. And the storm lifted. Even though I still get scared sometimes. My monster's a lot smaller now. Though I still hear it, roam in the halls at night. It still taps on my shoulder at school. But it's not as scary as it used to be. I showed my monster to my friends. And together we made a plan. They told me it's going to be okay. We can be there for each other. We can defeat it together. My monster is now a distant memory. As small as a pin. Like a tiny speck of dust. Floating away from my brain. So what are we going to play? Monsters? If we talk about our monsters, they might hear us and get smaller and smaller and smaller. Mm -hmm.